Good afternoon, Twin Tiers. It is almost 1210 on your Friday afternoon. Thanks for tuning back into WENY News at Noon. Live look at our radar and well, it's pretty quiet this afternoon. We're going to see partly cloudy skies throughout the afternoon hours and then the radar is going to fill up later tonight with a few passing clouds and then better chance for it to completely fill up with rain and thunderstorms comes later on tomorrow. And going into Sunday, we're going to see a cold front move into the area throughout the afternoon on Saturday. And then we're going to see showers and storms Saturday night and lingering into the first part of your Sunday. But let's switch back over to our weather graphics and show you this viewer picture we got from Jamie Ziegler at Tanglewood Nature Center. Very nice picture here. A little deer hiding underneath the shrubbery there. And if you have a weather picture, feel free to send it in to us here at WENY News on our Facebook page or our email address. And maybe you'll see your picture on air. For today, though, our weather story we're looking at. Another warm and humid day today. Temperatures not going to be humidity that is isn't going to be oppressive out there, but it is going to be quite humid out there throughout the afternoon hours. Temperatures stay warming up into the mid 80s, 86, the five degree guarantee today. Like I mentioned, scattered showers and thunderstorms arrive late in Saturday as a cold front approaches the area and we're going to see showers and storms Saturday night and going into Sunday morning. Still some lingering showers, but much cooler conditions are in store Sunday behind the cold front. We'll have that all coming up in my seven day forecast. Right now, temperatures across the viewing area, 78 in Dansville, already into the upper 70s, 76 in Corning, 77 right now in Elmira, 76 in Tawanda. Temperatures across the region this afternoon, 81 already in Erie, 80 in Pittsburgh, Altoona reporting 76 in New York City, just shy of 80 degrees so far at this hour. Like I mentioned, dew points right now. This is how we tell how humid it is out there. We're already at 55 degrees in Elmira. You can see some 60s down off to our south and west. And we're going to be getting into the lower 60s today, so it's going to feel right on the edge of the pleasant and going into the muggy area right now today. Not oppressive, but it's going to be a little warm out there if you're headed out this afternoon. It's going to be nice out there because look at the radar. It's generally clear. We're seeing mainly sunny skies, a few clouds pushing in from the west, and that's going to leave us with some partly cloudy skies this evening and going into the overnight hours. Tomorrow we might see a stray shower early in the day. Best chance for some rain comes late in the day on Saturday and going into the first part of your Sunday. And we'll track that out here on your future cast. Clear right now through 3 o'clock. We're looking at generally clear skies across the Twin Tiers. Tonight looks A-OK -okay with a few passing clouds. Stray shower possible, especially across the northern tier. Can't rule it out, but a very, very slight chance. A better chance comes tomorrow afternoon. For the first part of your day tomorrow, 5 o'clock in the morning, throughout the morning hours, we stay clear, sunny skies, and then by 3 o'clock, we start to see showers and storms move into the area. Best chance as the cold front approaches late tomorrow and going into Sunday for some showers and storms, and can't rule out a few of those to be severe Saturday night as well. Your first warning, seven-day forecast, mapping it out for you. 86 today, the 5-degree guarantee, warm again and humid out there. And then take a look at that. We cool it right down into Sunday behind that cold front. Only 59 degrees. It's going to be a complete turnaround there. And then a slow warm up next week. 67 Monday and then back up into the 80s come Thursday. But after the weekend rain, looking pretty nice next week. Look at that temperature drop off I going from sun, uh, Saturday into Sunday. It's unbelievable. So why is that? The cold front's going to move through and behind it's going to bring some cold air down from Canada behind all that rain that we're going to see tonight. So all that humidity is going to be going away too with Definitely. it. Definitely. All right. Thank you very much, Ryan. You're welcome.